Yo there guys, what is all loot games at? and today we are back in Alsa's lovely world. Now you guys have been very, very helpful in the comments. I'm going to leave a few on the screen. The ones that have helped me out the most recently and a couple of just random ones. I'll leave on the screen now and you guys have been awesome. Woo, look what we got here. Beautiful. Okay, so anyway, yeah, you guys have been really helpful recently. I've got to say thank you so much. So welcome back to Alice's Lovely World. As I say, we're on Troy 1.3 if you're wondering what the edition is. Because someone asked me, uh, what, wait, wait, what? Troy 1.3 is on Xbox now? And yeah, it definitely is. Now today we are heading over to the jungle biome to try and kill Queen Bee again. And just to explore the jungle a bit. And you might be thinking I'm progressing a little bit slow. But you've got to remember it's expert mode and I do a lot of it on camera. I don't like doing too much off camera as I always say. Um, it just feels like I'm skipping too much and I don't know why. It just always feels that way. Uh, so I do like a lot of raw Let's Play videos. I like to watch them myself, and uh, you guys are loving the episodes too. So it's really cool to sit back, relax, talk with you guys, and have a bit of fun along the way about some random stuff. So that is awesome. We did uh, manage to grow some day blooms, so I did actually get a few potions so that we can fight the uh, Queen Bee and maybe Skeletron later on in the episodes. We don't know, but I did go over to the dungeon. I died because the, uh, Skeletron Prime got me. I knew it was uh, too far down, and basically, if I don't know if the death is going to be there now. Okay, no, it's not. Basically, what happened is I died there. You can see the, the gravestone anyway. There it is. Um, It was there. The, the, the water bowl was exactly there, and that is one layer below. Now, there's a layer of, like, um, it's sort of, like, platforms. Oh, God, I forgot. It doesn't pause. A lot of people are telling me to pause the game as well when I'm in, like, uh, when I'm talking about things. But even pausing the game doesn't actually stop it now. But, yeah. Anyway, we've got the um, water bowl now, and it's the Celestial water bowl. I haven't reforged this. We do need to look around for the Goblin Tinkerer that we can get him. That's one of the reasons I want to explore the jungle as well, because he can spawn anywhere, pretty much, in the underworld or anywhere like that. Oh, I forgot we didn't mine this out. It's, like, so annoying. So, yeah, we're going to head over to the jungle. It's not going to take as long to get there now. We're quite fast. Luckily, we are actually quite speedy. But, yeah, again, like I said last time, I haven't really done much from the episode, but... You guys' help has been amazing. I just want to say thank you so much for supporting this series as well. If you do leave a like, it means a lot. I know I say every episode and put a pop-up, but it really does help. It's been making these episodes so much better. And I think it's been posting it to more of you guys. More of you guys have been getting the notifications. So it's been awesome. And I've just, just got to say thank you so much for that. I mean, I wouldn't have any different way. You guys are all awesome. And well, let's have a look. So yeah. Anyway, like I was going to say before, when I mentioned that, um, we are going to fill up these bottles with honey. Because I re if I remember rightly, they do a lot more dam uh, healing than a normal healing potion would. So I think a normal healing potion does 50 or something along the lines of that. I don't remember the exact amount. Or maybe 70. And I know that honey does a little bit more. And someone actually commented that. So that was one of the awesome comments that I got. So thank you so much, dude. Really appreciate that. But we're going to head out over here then. There we go. I don't know whether to get rid of the Brand of Cthulhu um, thing, you know. What's that actually give me? Okay, it gives me plus four defense. Yeah, it's worth having it. it. Definitely is worth having it. And unfortunately, my cold has got a little bit worse as well. So if I do sound a little bit different or a bit, you know, blocked up at times, that's the reason. I might take a little break like then. I actually cut out the video so you didn't see it. But basically, I took a little break uh, because I need to basically blow my nose so yeah i know it sounds grim and horrible so i'm not gonna go on up too much about that but hopefully you guys are all doing well of course it's cold and it's actually been snowing in the uk which is insane when i'm recording this is monday but this episode will probably come out on wednesday yeah probably wednesday so you'll see it by wednesday and hopefully by then you guys would have saw all the awesome comments and you would have had snow which is amazing I love these bullets so much. It's just a shame they don't do more damage. If they did, I would totally use this all the time. Like, all the time. But, um, yeah, sadly we can't. It's a normal frog. See what I mean? The bullets were still bouncing around, which is awesome. But we do have the uh, this summer on at the minute. But I'm thinking I'm going to swap with my meteorite when we get down there for the fight. Because uh, we can basically use unlimited space gun bullets. And we're going to be using the water bowl anyway. So uh, the actual meteorite armor gives you bonus. Yeah, 7% increased magic. Magic and magic so it gives you an increase in magic and I'm pretty sure the whole set gives you an overall total increase in magic more Pretty sure it is uh, something like that anyway It gives you a higher increase of magic and we have got to go grab that. Oh wait, what? 
Huh? What is... That's weird. We've not even been down here. But it's been explored. I think that's the one we take in that time, you know, when my footage crashed. That is weird. But anyway, it looks like we can go straight there then and fight the Queen Bee. I've got a good, I've got a good, um... Wait, what's happening? <laughs> anyway, there we go. I don't know what happened there. Anyway, I've got a good feeling about this. I've, I've got a good, good feeling about today that we can kill it. I mean, the water spell gives me a lot more confidence in what I do. So I'm hoping that that does pull us through. But what I might do... Uh, well, actually, while I'm in here, I want to keep my uh, this on. Because if I don't, then I'm definitely going to... Uh, <laughs> Definitely gonna die because this has a uh, good regeneration. Basically, that's all it is. How many torches do I have? Two, really? I've got two torches to light the whole area. Wow! Oh, come on, cobwebs. Here we go, lovely. It's two torches to light up the whole area. Okay, there we go. Get away from them. We don't want those guys sacking us. They can be deadly. Especially in expert mode, they are very, very deadly. If they can nip you and get you. Them, them jungle slimes, well, they're annoying. If they get you, they poison you. And the poison on expert mode is insane. Like, seriously, guys. Well, there we go. Let's kill this man eater quickly. This one's going to get us, you see. So I, I, I want to get rid of it as soon as possible. Come on. Come back up. Yeah, there we go. Come back up. Oh, I've run out of bullets. See, this is a lot faster, I suppose. That's that's where the damage comes in. There we go. We got it. Why aren't we using our water bolt? We should just totally use our water bolt. That'd be, like, so much powerfuller. And it bounces around for, like, three times. So, yeah. See what I mean? I can do that. And get, get lo loads of enemies. It's going to be so better. But the only problem is my mana. I'm probably best off equipping the this armor. Yeah, there we go. Okay, we get a little less defense, but we get more damage with our mage. So, yeah. It's good. It's good. Look at that. Look at that. And that's going to bounce around and kill him, hopefully. No, 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 no. Don't trap me in here. Do not trap me in here. I'm trapped. I'm trapped. I'm fully trapped. I'm fully trapped. I can't do nothing. Guys, I'm trapped in here. How, do, how can you get in places... And not out of them. <laughs> I've never understood that with Terraria. You can get in places and then not be able to get out of them. Which is so random sometimes. I don't know. My health is awfully low. Let me get this armor back on. Just so we can get a bit of regeneration on the go. Because I'm not I'm not liking my... Uh... I mean, we can get down there as well. Oh, God. Not lag beetles. They're annoying. Come on. Lag beetle done. Oh. Whew. I forgot you could even get them in easy mode. I thought that was only a hard mode thing. Lucky we've got some honey as well to regen us. Jeez. Right, do you have to make the honey with the... Okay, cool. Yeah, 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 you do. 80 HP. I'm pretty sure that's more. How much do, th do these heal? 50. Yeah, we get 30 more, which means we get a little bit more chance to live, hopefully. I'm going to make a ton of honey. There we go. Okay, maybe... Did I go overkill there? <laughs> maybe a little overkill. I didn't need that much honey, did I? No, no, I, I really didn't. <laughs> And that, that is our death last time. What did we get? Alsa flailing. Was, oh, okay. We was stopped by the Queen Bee, which is fully understandable. Because the Queen Bee can be a right pain if you don't have the right weapons. Uh, but we did do a lot of damage. I reckon we got about halfway. And then, yeah. But the Queen Bee has a specific set of moves. It just gets faster and faster and faster. So as long as you can get a combat that, you're all good. But what I'm doing now is taking these mahogany planks... Or platform, sorry. So we can go fight the, the other one down here. And then hopefully have a better chance in it. Because that's bigger, a bigger arena. Meaning we can hit it more. Meaning that our water bot will probably bounce around more. Hopefully anyway. I don't know for definite if that will happen. But I'm really hoping it will. Because that would be amazing. Is that going to... Yeah, I thought it would break. <laughs> there we go. We could probably trash some of our junk as well to pick all these up. Right, we need to definitely do that first. So we're going to trash the tin ore. Yep, there we go. There we go. If we just slowly take it in. Well, I might take the torch as well so I can light up the area. Because it's going to be really dark in there. Like, really dark. Right, cool. Sweet. There we go. Right, now let's put this armor back on. Because we've, we've pretty much regened all of our... Well, we have regened all of our life. Which is good. And then... Go grab this torch as well. And let's... Uh, we're going to go out the way we came. It's a bit dark. Jeez, look at that. We, we literally cannot get up there. Right, 
There we go. Lovely. Look at that. Ninja skills. We don't have our uh, ninja thing on, though. You know, the nin ninja claw or something? Is it a ninja claw? Yeah, angry climbing claws. We don't have the climbing claws on, so uh, we've got to be very, very careful. Because I, I like to scale buildings. It's like one of the be best things to do ever. Scaling buildings. Okay, no, 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 we don't want to be in here. We do not want to be in here. This place we don't want to be. Okay, we're going to be careful of this, these man eaters as well. They can be very, very dangerous. We've got to be cautious of those. That's it. Take them down at a distance. That's all we need to do. Take them down at a distance. As long as we can do that, then there's a lot of man eaters down here, which I'm not liking. I'm not liking my look down here. There's a piranha right on my butt as well. Go away, piranha. <laughs> we don't want you. All right, there's a spike jungle slime as well, which we will take out swiftly. There we go. Go, take him out. It's too fast. Way too fast for me. But uh, yeah, uh, someone actually said in the uh, last episode that I forgot about the Amazon as well. So I didn't forget about the Amazon at all. I'm actually collecting things down here so that I can make the Amazon eventually. But I don't want to make it straight away because it just, I don't know. I know it's cheap to make and all, but you do need to farm some of the things. And I reckon we'll be down here anyway. We'll probably get some of the things like that, like th uh, stingers, thorns, you name it. Come on. Oh, I'm just going to go in with this. Go, lovely. Get it bouncing around. And we'll go up here with this as well. Huh. There we go. Beautiful. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. We even got some life off that one, which is great. Fantastic. Right, let's get up here then. It's not, 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 not a very little bit area, but we should be good. Should be all great. Fantastic. Right. I reckon there's a route all the way. Yeah, there is. There's a route all the way down here anyway. So we're all safe on that one. Go. And then all we need to do is break in from the side. So we're just going to do that with our Reaver Shark. Here we go. We should be able to kill the bees, no problem. Oh, unless they do knockback like that. Jeez. Don't knock me back like that. Crazy amount of knockback that is. All right, we got in. We're in. <laughs> we're letting loads of honey out here, though. Okay, what's happening? Where are the, be where are the bees? Are, are, they, are they still alive? I thought, I thought we took... Oh, I thought we'd taken them down. Oh, that was intense. Right. What we need to do now is get our platforms. And let's do this. Platforms at the ready. We're going to kick kick its butt like crazy. We really... We're probably not. We're going to get killed, aren't we? <laughs> we're going to get killed. We're going to get we're gonna get our butt kicked. <laughs> probably, the, probably the case, to be fair. It's what normally happens with me. I normally get my butt kicked. Never mind the other way around. Right, there we go. And we want to leave enough space so we can spam water bolts at the top. So we might want to get rid of this top area here. That might be a good idea. Yeah, I know more honey's going to drop down, but it should be good. Oh, these bees are so annoying. So, so annoying. There we go. Sweet. Because if it does go in the honey, uh, or in the block, sorry, then we're going to have a problem getting it out of the blocks. So that's what I'm saying. If we destroy that now, we should be good. Right, one more layer and we should be safe. Let's put some more torches down so we can see properly. See what we're doing. Beautiful. There we go. And now what we need to do is pick up these blocks, I reckon. Yeah, why not? Jal, we don't need Jal that much. Actually, hmm. We probably don't need one vertebrae, do we? <laughs> nah, we don't, we don't need that. The honey, the hive blocks might come in handy. You see, that's why I say, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, no. Oh, no. I didn't mean that. Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, no, no, no. There we go. Sweet. Get these water bolts out. Oh, no. I didn't, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to do it on the platform. I don't feel safe. I don't feel comfortable doing this now. No. I don't feel comfortable. Okay, I've not even I'm not even used my uh, healing up. Quick, quick foe or foo, whatever you want to call it. I don't know what it's called. Okay, water bolt, go, 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 go. We're doing some good damage anyway, so that's uh, that's the key part. Okay, that is the key part here. Right, back to the water bolt again. Water bolt, go, go down. Yeah, there we go. And we're gonna spam it around. Up. There we go. Just gotta keep keep it going. There we go, lovely. As long as we keep all this damage going on, it'll be good. It's taking a lot of damage, so it's great. But the thing is, the problem is, I weren't ready for that. I wanted one more layer at least. One more platform. <laughs> I don't like it. Okay. Right, we, need, we need to get our uh, water bot back out. We go. Wonderful. Killed all the bees. All the bees. Take down all the bees. That's it. Lovely. There's so many bees right now. It's insane. That's it. Bees gone. Right, water bot back out again. 
We go. Can we heal back up? With I don't even know if we can heal back up yet. Right. Can we heal up? Yes, we can. Beautiful. Okay, jump. No, I didn't jump in time. Okay, there we go. No, no, we're taking loads of damage. No, this is probably the only attempt that anyone's ever done where they've actually struggled killing Queen Bee. Queen Bee as well. Nothing else, just a Queen Bee. Nothing hard, just, just to quit, just a bee. That's all it is, a bee. Okay. To be or not to be? That's the question. <laughs> right, no, it's Queen Bee. <laughs> that was a terrible joke. Anyway, there we go. Ah, oh, come on. Keep this going. We need to keep this up as much as we can. As much as we can. Alright. Oh, I thought it was going to do its charge attack. And it didn't do it. Now? No more bees. No, 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 no! Are you kidding me? I was not re- oh, That's annoying. Because I got so close there as well. That was- oh, We had that in the bag. If I would have had one more layer, I would have been sorted. But no, I didn't have one more layer, did I? I was a noob. Ah, <sighs> whatever. Anyway, Queen Bee is proving to be a quite hard fight. But anyway, let's see if we have enough things to make the Amazon now. I don't actually know how to make the Amazon. I think we might be missing uh, the blocks for it. Like, you know, the, the tree blocks. But we might be able to make those. I think this bot is a borrow wood or, or rich mahogany. It might be rich mahogany, but we can make a few of those anyway, because luckily we do have the um, platforms. So we may be able to make it now. We have the mahogany platforms, we have stingers, and we have vine. So is that everything to make the Amazon? Hopefully it is. Let's go and have a look. It should be made at the anvil, uh, I'm pretty sure. But I don't know. Maybe, maybe it's not. Maybe it's made somewhere else. Who knows? Yeah, the Amazon can't be made here, uh, but where could it be made? I'm not too sure. Maybe I'm missing an ingredient. Maybe jungle spores? Do I have any jungle spores? I don't think I have. Like, they're things that I don't normally come across. Perhaps I do have some somewhere. I don't know. There's got to be surely I've got some jungle spores while being in the jungle. Hopefully I haven't trashed them. <laughs> That'd be the worst thing ever. I don't know. I think that's the only thing I'm missing. Jungle spores. Perhaps I am. Perhaps I'm not. Again, I don't really know. But how do you get jungle spores then? Are they from jungle plants or or what? I really don't know. But I think that's what we are missing because I, I know you can get jungle spores and that seems the only logical thing. So let's go over to our jungle and see if we can find any jungle spores. That's the only thing I really think of that we're, we're missing out from the Amazon. So here we are over in the jungle now. We are back here and what we're looking for is the jungle spores now. And that's sort of like the... I don't know. The, it's hard to explain but basically it's like an orb of light uh, that you see around the jungle. And sometimes you mistake them for other things like chests. And things like that. They sort of look like the torches. Yeah, that, that's the easiest way I can put it. But I don't know where they, like, uh, spawn. I'm not too sure. But that's the only ingredient that I'm missing. Jungle. I did take a quick look on the wiki. And it was jungle spores. So I was right. I was correct. For something for a change. I actually got something right. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. We're going to have to look around for those then. Which there should be loads. Like, I've got... Couldn't, I couldn't imagine why there wouldn't be loads. There's got to be loads. <laughs> They light up anyway, so we'll see them. They should be easy to find. It's just finding them is the hardest part. Even though I just said they're easy to find, finding them is the hardest part. And I thought that was one then, but it's not. There's so many jungle slimes around as well. Spike jungle slimes are so annoying. Like seriously, right? I've got to put the other armor back on. I don't. I don't feel. I just don't feel safe. Not. Not a single bit. Not a single bit. Right, let's trash the mud blocks, because we don't need mud. And let's trash... We don't really need pink bricks, because we can get them anytime we want. So, yeah, let's trash those as well. Let's light up the area a little bit. Beautiful. Now, let's go grab our money back. Oh, wait. It's not from here, is it? Nope. We've just come the wrong way. But at least there's a, there's a jungle spore there. I can see it. Wait, let's just uh, get to this jungle spore. I don't even care if I die now. YOLO. Let's just YOLO it. Right, there we go. Right, jungle spores. There's two there. We need four in total, I believe. So, I think... Do you get one off one or... Oh, you get two. I probably should have enough jungle spores now. But I can't see a single thing. Can't see what I'm doing, so... Doesn't really help, does it? Oh, God. 
Water's gonna meet you, honey. It's gonna make crispy blocks. It's gonna make the crispy blocks. Oh no. Okay, we've got a mm, invisibility potion there. They're useless. No point in collecting that. Pretty sure we've got the ingredients now, though. Ooh, gravitation potion. That will help out. That will be a bit helpful. It really will. Uh, right, we're going to swap that with... Oh, we've only got one of those. We, we, we've grown those at the minute at home anyway. So we should be all good for those. But I can't believe I wasted another br uh, bee, queen bee. Sucks, man. Sucks to be me. Oh, a giant shelly. Bones McGee. <gasps> What's it? I didn't know this could attack you. Bone, I want to talk to Bones McGee. Leave Bones McGee alone. Anyway, who's Bones McGee? Hey, bro. Wait, you're selling a purple counterweight. And you're selling strange... Br it looks in the smart... Restores 400 mana on 80 life? What? What? No way. That is sick. I don't have a lot of money, though. No, what can I sell to him to get me money? The meat, shall I sell my meat, you right? Because I don't really need it, do I? <gasps> that's giving me five gold. That means I can get loads of strange brews. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. But, oh, can I, I can only carry 30 anyway. I can sell back those back to you, then. And a, a counterweight. I guess that would come in handy, wouldn't it? Can I not buy one? No? Okay, let me, let me try to sell something to him. Like the cobwebs or something. It still won't let me buy one. Oh, it's because I don't have five gold. Oh. Uh, what can we sell for five gold? Maybe some bullets? No, okay, that's not going to get me very far, is it? We can sell some mana stars. No, that's not going to get me far either. How much are these worth? 30 silver each. Wait, how much do they buy for? Wait, what? Hang on. Oh, right. That's the whole lot for 30 silver. Doesn't matter. I thought I thought I ripped him off, though. I was like, huh? <laughs> so weird. What am, what am I even talking about? Okay, so I can sell... Well, I can't sell anything. I'm done for. I literally cannot sell it. I could sell my... Uh... I really want to get that counterweight really badly. But I don't have the money for it. That's the problem. <laughs> so, I could probably sell these. That's giving me 30 silver. I'm not going to get enough, am I? No value. No va Two silver. 40 copper. Lead ores. 42 silver. And that gives me enough. There we go. Ah. Finally. I mean, I, I did... Ah. I really want to buy my lead back now. <laughs> I got my seven. I don't need the red. The, the bugs... They are. We can get fireflies anytime. Well, Bones McGee, you've been a legend, bro. Thank you very much for that. Thank you. I've just thought something. We died, didn't we? So my money will be down here. Somewhere. I don't know where. Did we already pick it up? Or did it disappear? Or did it get robbed? That's what normally I... Oh no, it'd be down here, won't it? Duh, it's right there. It is right there. Are you kidding me? So It's only one gold, but... One gold's one gold at the end of the day. Oh, he hasn't got my stuff. Although he has got bombs now. He didn't have those before. Those strange brews are going to be sick, though. Can you only eat one at a time, or can you have as many as you want? Okay, yeah, it does have a cooldown time. I just wanted to see if it had a cooldown. Wait. Does that give us an effect as well? I thought we had some, some sort of effect on us. Anyway, let's go back home. We've got what we need, I think. Hopefully. I, I really hope we do now. Let's have a look. See if we can make the Amazon or Amazon. It's just Amazon. It's not the Amazon. It's just Amazon. But let's see if we can make it. We can. There we go. We do have a counterweight now. 22 melee damage. There we go. Lovely. Okay. Sweet. We are in business. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Oh, yeah. Right. Let's uh, trash all my stuff. We're not trash it, but put it in the chests. There we go. Anything we don't need. Boom. And then we'll get that out as well. Because we could probably put that in the chest as two. Beautiful. I'm going to put the bombs in here. We're going to put... We could probably put the honey away now as well, because we're not going to use it, are we? We're not going to use it at all. Not at all. Go, let's put that there, put that there. Just a little bit, little bit organized. While it's not really that organized, but let's go trade in our mysterious plant as well. Go, strange plant. Boom. Reflective silver dye. Ooh. What's that look like? 
Okay, that looks pretty cool, but no, I don't like it. I don't like it. We're going to keep our dark blue and black on. That looks sweet. Right, and we've got all of our stuff grown up here too, which is amazing. Oh, yeah, let's take all that. Boom, boom. So many day blooms and day bloom seeds. So good. Oh, we just took our campfire up. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Let's put that back down. There we go. Lovely. We have a campfire back down now. And we have a ton of day blooms. Sweet. We've got we've got materials for days. We can make loads of potions. And that's what I'm really looking forward to. Making potions and stuff like that. So we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Right. We're going to put these in here. Beautiful. We have loads of uh, mushrooms too, which is good. Stingers there too. We've got the counter. What, what does counterweight actually do? Throws a counterweight after hitting an enemy. So does that do damage or, or what? I'm not too sure. It's equipable anyway. What can we replace it with though? Maybe the... I don't know. Should we try just put it in here? Because I don't know if I'm going to use it or not. That's the problem. Probably not going to use the shackle. So anyway, can the counterweight be used without having it equipped? Or do you have to have it equipped? So if I've got to have it equipped, I probably won't use it. Because it's going to be a thing that just... Um... So let's get up here anyway. Let's give it a test. Because this is a brand new weapon here. Go... Okay, I mean, not bad. It's quite a good, uh, quite a good little thing there. Let's go test it on an enemy. Apparently, what well, what's it do? Throws the counterweight after hitting an enemy with with a yo-yo. Okay, so I, I want to know what the counterweight is. Is it another shot or is it just like something extra? I'm not too sure. I really don't know. Come on, hit an enemy. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. The counterweight does like the. Oh, that's cool. So it does, like, extra damage then? Oh, that's sweet. There we go. Look at that. So you can pretty much... Can you have unlimited of those, or is it just the one? Okay, you just get the one counterweight that goes around, and I suppose it just does a bit more damage. That's, that's cool, but I don't think I'm going to use it. Let's just uh, see if it works when we're like that. Let's see if that works. No, okay, that didn't work. But that's still a lot of damage. That's still awesome. 20-odd damage each one. It's going to be great against the uh, Queen Bee, I reckon. Or maybe even Skeletron. I don't know. But we can use that and then uh, use that as well. So we've got like a melee weapon and a Celestial Water Bot 2, which is awesome. And I think this gives a melee. Yeah, it gives you greater melee damage, which this, with, I think yo-yos do count as melee. Do they? They do. 22 melee damage, which is awesome. But anyway, guys, that's been it today then. That is awesome. We need to go and see if we can fight Skeletron next time. I think we, we're about ready for him now. Maybe. I don't know. I'll see if I can make more potions as well. Do comment below if you know any potions that I can make. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Please don't subscribe. Stay frosty. And peace.